All right. Good morning. I wanted to wear this other pair of pants, but the boys' pants, my my thighs, wouldn't uh, come up. It wouldn't come up past my uh, well. It came up past my thighs. I brought it up, but it it had a long long torso on it. And I didn't. So, what are you doing today? You know where I gotta be? Huh? It's Thursday. I've got college. What class do I have? Hmm. You freaking liars? Oh, she's on work release. Look, Jackie graduated. Cause see, you know what? My brother Jack was in prison for over, like, what, 12 years? He was uh, in prison. Anyway. Hold on. So, who's going to lie today? Hmm? Where are you going to be at? Today's Thursday. You know who has always like courts? There used to be. Municipal uh, courts have to maybe uh, have, different uh, church. Well, good for you to take complaints that step, sir, because and so often we have files and stuff and like that. What time is it? What time, time you gotta be there? Eleven o'clock. What time you gotta be there? Eleven o'clock. And now look mm. at how happy no. you are. I know it's something I waited thirty-nine years for. I got this from the the library last night. They gave it to me. Cindy Merck knows me. You did it. Okay. Cindy Merck. The owner of Sentinel. Okay. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. I talked to her from day one. She's the one that called me. I was talking to her about primary and asking her about a couple of people, you know, to, you know, their, her opinions on a couple of people. I was talking to her. And she put, she actually put the memorandum in, in the Sentinel in 2014 for me. And uh, I think that's, that's actually on Facebook, that picture of, of the, um, the memorandum for Doreen. So, meanwhile, I'm on the phone with her, and she's like, do you mind me asking what happened with, to Doreen? And I told her it was an accident. She says, oh, off record. You better believe it was off record. Let me tell you something. If Cindy Murr testified on what I talked to her about privately as supposedly a friend, it's inadmissible. Do you understand me? She knows me, and that whole goddamn committee members know me. So if somebody's going in there causing me issues, and they know what's going on in this goddamn town, I feel sorry. Because I was told this is the most corrupt state in the world. So that's why, you know what? We needed some honest, good to honest people. And you know what? I like, I'm sorry, but I like Chris Christie. And I hopefully I voted for his relative anyway. That's besides the point. So, I have to look that up more closely. But it, I don't really need to. Anyway. Anyway. And I like Trump. I had skeptical feelings about Clinton because of the fact that how can a woman I don't know because women he had power and the, sh the shit that went on with Mr. The, the, the husband and and M Monica Lewinsky and shit, you know, and, but she still stuck by his, her husband, which is good. I mean, that's a good thing, but then, you know, I'm not going to go on my opinions on that right now, but I'm just saying, I'm going to college. There's municipal courts today, and if anybody's sitting there lying, and these judges are helping you, I feel sorry. 
as the guy says, we need good judges. We need better judges. We got too many corrupt judges going on around here. They started the corrupt judge. The first corrupt judge that started was the one who fucking married me. Who helped steal my children in 2005. And I wasn't even barely drinking then. I wasn't even partying. I didn't do nothing wrong. That was the problem. So they had to dig and dig and dig and dig and dig so far into my goddamn co family and my past. They had to pull up shit and they don't even freaking know me. Then they had to falsify shit. Then they had to go to my buddies. My buddies. Yeah. Oh, you... So you want to be somebody's buddy? Yeah, he's my buddy. My buddy. And if you hurt my buddy, I'm going to make sure you get it ten times fold. You don't hurt my friends. You don't hurt the ones I love. Ever. Hurt the ones that I've loved. I call my son, buddy. Call everybody, buddy. I'm gonna just keep praising God. my tea and go. I'm going to keep praising God. Now who's going to lie today? Who has the balls enough to stand up to me? You've already seen the footage. I bounce. I bounce. I bend. I don't break. That's why nobody will hit, mess with me. And if they do, they better make it a good one. Make sure they knock me out. Because I ain't coming back. I'm going to, usually I walk away. But to the world, I've been pushed over the limit. Hey, as they do. You push somebody over the limit, they push him over to the, to the other side of the world. But guess what? I still have the light inside me. And I'm going to see the end of that tunnel. That light is going to shine. I will shine again. So, praise God. Hope is in front of me and my children. Please be with us. Praise God. Amen. Where's my earrings? I found one. Where's my other one? Alright. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you to all my brothers and sisters. Peace be with you.